What if I told you that you can change the icons on your home screen in iOS 10.3 and you don't need jailbreak? What is going on guys, Apple Fox here and today we are going to be talking about something what could be called revolutionary but it's not completely what we want. So besides the changes and new features that were added to our iPhones in iOS 10.3, Apple has also allowed people to change the look of the icons on the home screen. We are not talking about jailbreak at all. You can of course do it in case you have your iPhone jailbroken without any problems. So how do you go ahead and change the design of the app icon on your homepage? Well, app developers are now able to change it or let you change it. For example, in Winner, you may get different design of the icon, possibly with some snowflakes or something like that. So this is what Apple intended to bring to our devices. Since the iOS 10.3 has just been released a couple days back, there are many developers that already took use of this, but of course there are some. For example, the NHL app is now able to do this. If you just open up the App Store and search for NHL, the first thing you can see is this new feature. So they really consider this feature as something brand new and as something that will make you download the NHL app. It's not that easy, however. This means that you just can't choose a picture from your gallery or take a photo and use that photo in the icon. The developers don't really want that, so what they allow you to do is to set the logo of your favorite NHL team as the icon. So for example, I'm fan of LA Kings and in the NHL app, I click on the settings, I can see here the menu where I can change the NHL icon on my home screen to represent my favorite team. But because my favorite team is LA Kings, I have their logo up here so I don't have to scroll through all of the teams to find it. But Having the king set as my favorite doesn't mean I cannot pick another logo to appear on my home screen. So I can scroll down here and pick any of those icons basically. You of course have every single team here to choose. There aren't many apps able to take use of this, at least right now. It's because iOS 10.3 has just dropped and many developers didn't really have time to implement this into their apps. But we should definitely see more and more apps being able to change their icon on the home screen. As I said, besides setting your favorite team on the icon, I don't really see what you could be able to put there. Maybe some season-based icon modifications like for example Chrome or any other third-party application may receive a slightly changed look during Christmas or Easter, so this is how I see it. But for now, another app you can use right now that already uses this is the MLB app. Well, if you're guessing that it's gonna be something similar to the NHL app, then you're right. So you can change the icon on your home screen, but again, you are limited to the teams playing MLB. And just like in the NHL, you can pick your favorite team or any other team you want to be displayed on your home screen. For example, I can choose New York Yankees and their logo as my icon without any problems. I don't really watch MLB that much as NHL, so I don't really know the players here and stuff, but for people who do know and watch their matches, this app might be very useful. Well, we finally have the ability to change the icon without updating the app. By the way, icons are changeable even in the older version of iOS. For example, Instagram has recently changed their logo, I'm still not sure if I like it, but anyways, the logo changed after you installed the update, and here you don't need to download any update to apply the changes. I really hope that this is the future of app icons, but being able to change it however we want is something that is still lacking in the iOS. Many people jailbreak their devices just for this and similar features that are available there but are not in stock iOS. So guys, thank you for watching, smash the like button if you enjoyed this video, have a great day, subscribe if you don't want to miss anything and see you next time.